Hello, everybody. So this is Mike Hill. He's going to talk about a pet project. Go okay. ahead, Mike. Go. Hi, I'm Mike Hill. Um, so yeah, I'm just talking about a little project that I worked on. Um, it doesn't directly involve a physical Commodore at the moment, but it is related, so bear with me. But uh, So what I tried to do was, um, if, if virtual reality had been invented in the 80s, what might it have looked like? And uh, some of you may have seen my previous project where I took video, live video and converted it to uh, Petsky characters. So the extension of that for this time is uh, I have two phones running, uh, running an app that uh, I'm capturing video from the camera here. And I'm capturing the video on two different phones. And together forms a retro style VR viewer, uh, pseudo viewer. So do you, this is a Google Cardboard. Some of you may have seen this. So I put two phones in here. Yeah. And when you look through, you see the world in pesky format. That's weird. So this is a little bit hard to film. <laughs> You can, yes, maybe I can show you. You're moving uh, really fast. <laughs> okay, I'll move slowly. Here, okay. You can take a look it's at slow motion. So this is yeah. I'm capturing video and converting into uh, okay, yeah, I saw Petsky, okay. pe Petsky characters. And now this will be kind of a show and tell experience. So you can pass this around to check it out. But if you you see through the two cameras here, and you it's you kind of relax your eyes and converge them, and you can see the world as if. You're seeing, you know, it's converted into pesky. So go ahead and pass it around. In 3D In pesky, 3D. huh? It's pretty weird. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, I just got it. Just like Captain Neo. Yeah. Wow, it, it takes a and second. Then, uh, and then the phones may run out of battery at some point, and then we'll just charge them up and we'll give it a second round. That is amazing. <laughs> See, it takes a second, and then uh, okay, that's incredibly cool. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and that's about it. That's the uh, that's the pet pet VR project. Um, uh, and enjoy. Yeah. Any questions? The like, pet happy VR to talk project. About it. So, yeah. uh, 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 so it's running pesky characters. Yeah. Um, so basically, just capturing capturing live video uh -huh. on each phone, and each each of the video frames, it's uh, chopping it up. And converting the little bits of each frame into each little subsegment of the frame is being converted to a Petsky character. And how many frames um, per second is it going? I think it's running about 15, oh, 12 about to 15, 15 frames, frames per, per second. second. Oh, yeah. 15 frames yeah. per second. And so sort of the limiting, the limiting factor there is just con the conversion of video of the actual image to Petsky. And can this like be a applied to like real pets? It uh, can actually. Well, what I have. What I unfortunately don't have with me now is that there is an interface where I can, it sends those frames wirelessly to a Raspberry Pi, which is then connected to a pet, and then it shows up on the pet screen. Um, Two different images? Yeah. Just one. It just shows one, one, of, the, one of the images. One Your of choice, the left one or the right one, whatever one you want. Mm -hmm. um, or you could have two pets. Two pets. I haven't done that yet, but, okay. but that would be pretty really cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. You would yeah. need a really big viewer. Big viewer with a hydraulic stereo. lift. Hydraulic lift, yes. From aliens, you know. The, the, the exoskeleton, exoskeleton to carry okay. it around. Well, okay. Um, well, that... But uh, that's my project, and yeah, pass it around, enjoy it. Um, Can you do an Android version? Uh, potentially, yeah. <laughs> it's, in the plan. it's in the works. It's in the works, yeah. It's in the works. As soon as I do the port, it'll be ready, yeah. Um, that's all. Any other questions, yeah. guys? Questions, questions? Is this uh, is this in beta state, alpha state? Uh, I would say yeah, alpha, alpha, alpha beta, yeah, <laughs> gamma. It, I don't know. Is it um, is it ready to be released to the general public in its alpha beta state? Uh, I think it needs a bit of needs a bit of work. Probably yeah. needs. Uh, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully. Oh no, the app store. Yeah, hopefully it could go in the app store. Yeah, oh, yeah. No. Currently, currently it's just running on uh, two iPhone, two iPhones, uh, but should be a relatively easy port to Android too. Um, just haven't done it yet, but uh, it's in the works, it's in the plans. Yeah. So, any other questions, guys? Yeah. For Cyclopses, um, yeah, for access Cyclops accessibility, you can just uh, hold it off to the side. I guess. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We don't want to forget our Cyclops brethren. You know. Who? <laughs> <laughs> our Cyclopean brothers. That's it.
That's it. Okay, yeah. thanks. Woo! Yeah, <laughs> our first presentation of the day.